Well, there it is. The big old volcanic Spinosaurus. We tamed this guy up last episode, and today it's time to unleash ship upon the world and see if he lives up to those ridiculously high expectations that I've set for it. If all goes according to plan, this guy here might be the game changer that I've been waiting for. I'm hoping that this guy can be the... Well, I don't know. A slaying machine. That's really all I want for it. And what's going to help us even further is it is a whopping level six. No, no, eight, 69. <laughs> 69. Uh, I think this guy, I think guy was like a level 560 when we tamed him up. But oh my goodness, I can't wait. I've been hanging out for this for so darn long. Guys, before we go any further, if you do enjoy the video, please go ahead, punch that thumbs up. Make it rain those thumbs ups. Now let's get to it. Ah, it feels like it's been such a long journey just to get here. We've, you know, we've tamed a few guys along the way. But what I've really been hanging out for, other than a lot of dodos, is just something we can charge around on and not risk dying constantly, I suppose. Just something we can just go on an absolute Salean spree with. And I think this is going to be that moment. Um, and the reason for that is because once we, I guess, get a dinosaur that can do this, that can accomplish these things, uh, hope, wait, over here. Uh, hopefully we can just build a ma- ah, no way. No way, I'm missing silica pearls. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Um, okay, okay, silica pearls. I need some silica pearls. We need silica pearls. I actually need silica pearls. Uh, I'm just trying to think of the best possible way to do this. Where's my dragon? <laughs> Where's my speedy ol? I don't know where whiplash is gone. We're gonna have to have a little search. Um, okay, beaver dams. I need to find a beaver dam if that's the case. There were a few over here last episode, but they may not be here. Oh, yeah, here they are. I don't think these have got silica pearls in them, but I'm going to use this as an opportunity to destroy the remains of them. That way, hopefully, we get a chance of these to respawn. I don't need all that wood right this second, so we'll just leave them for the time being. All right, fingers crossed we can have some form of beaver dam out here. Meanwhile, there's a fish just... That's a giant fish just kind of got picked up out of the water. Oh, my goodness. Um, over here is usually a good spot for these beaver dams. Unfortunately, these ones are guarded by some friends. Um, what do we got inside of these ones? 33 silica pearls. Perfect. That's exactly what I'm looking for. But hopefully I can quickly grab what we need and get our butts out of here before we cause any alarm with our friends down here. All right, we'll teleport back to the teleporter. Hopefully these guys don't follow me back home. In fact, we've actually got some beavers currently chilling around home, and hopefully those guys don't get aggressive. It looks like they haven't. Uh, but yeah, once we get this guy all powered up and crazily good, we should be able to just tear everything to pieces, or at least most things to pieces. We uh, we still got a lot of guys out there that are well outside of our our, our range, I suppose. There's demonics, there's shadows. Um, we've only seen a demonic dialo so far, but I know that there is also another demonic. Uh, one that I'm probably more afraid of out there somewhere that I'm sure we're going to encounter soon. Um, but yeah, when that time comes, we'll we'll see. We'll see. That's ideally what I want to tame one day as well. Um, but without further ado, it's time to see how strong this guy is. Do we test it on this poor little Triceratops and its child? Why not? Yeah, you know what? 6,000 damage is pretty darn good. A beaver. Oh my goodness. Yeah, that's that's it. That's the spud, baby. Why didn't this beaver get all angry? That was like slayed its friend. Who knows? Uh, and we don't even have our hydration buff yet either. So this guy's going to get even stronger as we go. Um, I do want to be a little careful over here though because I know that there's some shadow rock golems just chilling around. Um, but we should be okay. Just regular bite attack. It's four and a half thousand damage. Nice. Um, do we have any like fire breath attacks? We got a roar. X attack? No X, no control. Okay, it doesn't breathe fire. But I reckon what it does do... Uh, like, I saw some fire damage. I think when we hit creatures, yeah, we kind of, like, set them on fire a little bit. So, even if we don't one-shot a creature, which we're not going to be able to one-shot everything, um, we're going to set them on fire and deal, like, longer-term damage to them, which is which is good. For example, this guy over here. This is what I mean. We, we are... We, we're strong, but we're not... You know, we're not completely in control just yet. Um, we do have a little bit of knockback, though. That works amazingly. 
Um, how's that fire damage working on this guy right here? So this is what I've been... This is why, this is why we wanted this Spino, basically. So we can work on some of these, I guess, far, far higher tier creatures than we currently have access to. And we can build up a nice supply of you know, Mythic Blood, for example. Mythic Hide. We can get access to better weapons and better uh, armor. Better tranks. More tranks. And then we can just keep on taming things up. And then eventually, you know keep on getting stronger creatures these like the elementals are only the bottom of the barrel when you really think about it we still got shadow creatures we still got mythics and demonics um and i think there's new tiers coming along the way as well which hopefully get introduced to the game really really soon but uh we'll see how that one there goes let's quickly finish this guy off though and just like that get wrecked we've taken down a mythic should we try our hands on a shadow I think Shadow actually like a lower tier technically, but let's do it. 20,000? Why? Why am I dealing 20? That's, that's a ton of damage. I'll take it, but 20? Is it because I was like hitting headshots or something? Right, I'm not dealing 20,000 to this one, but still, wow. I don't even know how, what level this guy is. Yeah, there we go. 20, 20K? How does it dictate like if it's going to do 20 or 6 or what? That's nuts. Um, is he dead? I think so. Ooh, is that a beaver dam down there? If it was, it is now destroyed. Ah, right, let's keep moving. I want to get this guy nice and strong. Uh, how are we looking? 22 levels up our sleeve. And look at this. Ton of resources already. Uh, we do, though, have some of these medium experience potions. I don't know where these came from. I cannot remember. But let's jump them in there and see what we can do here, hey? We gain a lot of health every time we use these. So that's nice. We also get some health potions, which I can use to get us back, back good. Um, and then melee damage. That's what I want to be seeing. I want to see what sort of damage we can be dealing. And we're actually pretty close to level 1000, which is nuts. All right, health potion goes in. And let's keep going. 10,000 damage. Let's go. All right. So you might be wondering... What is the next tier for us to conquer? Because, I mean, the elemental is a good one to get to type of thing. But we want to keep on moving forwards. And uh, the next step is actually shadow. Unfortunately, though, to craft shadow kibble to tame shadow creatures, we're going to need... Well, we're going to need our spino here to lay eggs, which it is a female, so it will do. Probably not many of them. So we're probably going to need more volcanic tames. Um, who is that? <laughs> Piranha's attacking me. The audacity. But we're also going to need some of these turtles that, for some reason, are swimming backwards. <laughs> these guys here um, are also elementals. But we're going to need hydro eggs as well as volcanic eggs. And, in fact, we might even need the electric ones, too. Let me just have a quick little peek. I was looking at this earlier. Shadow kibble requires hydro egg, volcanic egg, and electric egg. So we are going to need more elemental teams, I suppose. Um, except that kibble's going to be really, really expensive. Ideally, though, when it comes to these hydro dinosaurs, we're going to be targeting low tier. So low level. I don't need no high level. In fact, that there. Three kibble. Perfect. Perfect. Exactly what I'm talking about. Um, but at the same time, we may as well go and kill these guys because I'm not going to be needing them. And we may as well get our hands on some, I, I guess, elemental blood. Is that what we're going to get out of these? Yeah, elemental blood. Nice. And some elemental hide maybe as well. I'm actually not sure. Let's have a look. There we go. What's this blood? Uh, this hide called? Hi oh, hydro hide. And then elemental blood. Oh, okay. Interesting. Okay, so wasn't expecting that. But it looks like hydro dinosaurs. And I assume electric and volcanic. I don't know because I've never killed them until now. Um, it looks like they might all give us different types of hides i don't know what those hides are going to be used for i'm probably going to check that in just a second see we head through like the engram list and we'll, and we'll see what that actually gets us access to um but interesting nonetheless demonic dialo up here he's got a lot of health i am very nervous about these guys um very very nervous about these guys I still get the feeling a demonic dialo will kill this as strong as it is. That thing is still like three or four tiers above us. I'm waiting for him to drop his big old explosion attack. 
but I'm kind of hoping also he doesn't. I don't want to get like caught in the crossfire of it or anything like that. Come on. You know what? I kind of want to see him do it. <laughs> Come on. Hey, there it goes. Yo. Yeah, light that place up. Well, I'm glad I'm on this side of the river. But uh, that's what we want power. That's what we want access to. That's what we're working towards. Except maybe stronger. We'll, we'll see when the time comes. All right. Ooh. What was that big old... I think when we're, when we're lighting all these guys on fire, they're like lighting up everything by the looks of it. Um, there's a few more of them down there. This is where we tamed up the spino. Those are low level ones. I might be able to get those guys killed. I kind of want to go for it. Oh, I got an idea. Oh, should I? What is that? It's a regular. It looks so small. Um, we got the four times explorer note nearby. If I were to stop and grab it, we could get this guy leveled up so darn quick. <laughs> All right, I've stayed away from those explosions. No, thank you very much. But I do want to have my shot at these guys. Can't think of a reason not to. Oh, yeah, that's a good reason not to. I take it back. Um, okay, I don't... Oh! Uh, oh, I'm on fire. I'm on fire. I personally am on fire. Oh, snap. I didn't even think of that. I'm not immune. Oh gosh, oh gosh. All right, I'm wasting a health potion on myself. I don't feel like dying. <laughs> uh, okay. Good reason not to mess with the demonics. I, as the rider, nearly died. My guy here was fine by a long shot, but still. Uh, yes, okay. Uh, why are they so aggressive? They're actually charging at me. Guys, what do you want? Yeah, fight him. Um, <laughs> do they do damage to him? He, they don't. He's only got like 10,000 health. I can one shot him. Get wrecked. But these guys, I, I actually got to be careful of them. They will. Yep, I'm on fire again. Okay, I can't afford to be consuming a health potion every time I get hit by one of those fireballs. <gasps> Another volcanic spino. Level 160. It's female. I don't have any kibble on me right now, but maybe I should go back home and see if we can craft any up. We could get like, well, we can get some pairs of them and get them kind of working on a bit of an egg farm for us, which is what we need. Another spino up here. What's that? An alpha. This does not look like an alpha. Another mythic. I just realized to knock these creatures out, we're going to have to, sorry, to, to, to tame them. We're going to have to knock them out as well. And we used up all our resources getting this guy uh, down. So what we should probably do is uh, rebuild our supply of knockouts as well. And that's going to involve us having to kill Mythic Dinosaur. Hold on a second. You guys heard that, right? You guys heard that sound? There's a brood mother nearby. We saw him the other day, I'm pretty sure. I can't remember. Yeah, he's over there. You can see. You can see. <laughs> you can see he's in there somewhere. There he is. Wait, Mythic Broodmother. Right? Did I just see that? Hold on. It's not a Shadow Broodmother? Or is there like multiple of them out here? I really feel like I shouldn't be heading out there, but curiosity. You guys know me. Curiosity gets the better of me and often gets me killed. Um, I don't want to get too close to where this guy might be, but... I'm, I just need to... Where is it? Oh, we got... Oh, hold on. We got Rainios. Oh, level 2,000 of Rainios. I might have just crashed. I think we just crashed. We just crashed. Oh, no. Oh, man. Ah. Oh. So, we lost a little bit of progress, but not the end of the world. Um, what I did notice, though, upon killing a... I think it was a mythical trike that I didn't kill last time. We got some extra health potions. Uh, not health potions. Experience potions. So, we can go and give this guy a little bit of extra juice. Because why not? Get him an extra 14 levels. And, uh, yeah, all into damage, obviously. But as you can see, we have quite a supply of uh, resources. I'm... Oh, did I just... You know what? I'm going to kill this. Oh, wait. No, I was talking about potentially taming this guy for extra eggs. Yeah, I'm going to leave that one there. I think what I'm going to do is head back home in a second. Uh, we're going to see what we actually have as far as eggs go and see if we've got the capacity to actually craft up some more um, elemental kibbles. And maybe we can get our hands on a hydro turtle 
or an electric whatever spawns in as electric but one more kill before we do head back and that's on this guy right here really quickly because now i deal a ton of damage and yeah there's still that brood mother but i'm i don't want to crash again so I'm, I'm trying to like keep my distance from going over there anyways this is a good time let's head where's my teleporter there we go let's head back to base with our now much more powerful spino who actually what level did we get him to because i'm kind of curious let's park him over here what level did he get to 936 okay not bad not bad not bad at all and uh you know what here have some more health potions we get some alpha uh, narcotics for that sweet have another level why not we got some team helpers potent narcotics more team helpers primal stimulants uh and a ton of just i mean i guess we'll bring all this inside as well we can go store it uh it's all gonna come in handy we need to be collecting as much of this as possible so yeah that's pretty sweet i also killed an alpha tech raptor just while i was redoing the undoing of my work what is going on with this roof of ours <laughs> it looks like my base is on fire um oh no where's all my stuff wait what i just realized all my uh decorations are gone hold on is this the visual bug or is this is there like a mod discrepancy or something something tells me just based on <laughs> the lighting in the roof currently the lights are there but we just can't see them i don't know we've had this happen in the past we've had this happen in the past so i i man now i'm gonna go back to like the first half of this video just to see if it's there or not um what a bizarre look i kind of want to keep it <laughs> it looks amazing all right let's just ignore it for the time being though and let's have a look can i get my hands on like 10 yes 10 elemental kibble coming right up but that's not all we need uh there is more there is more there is more i'm also gonna need some tranks which means first things first narcotics how many of these can i get my hands on 54 of these which means we can get about 27 darts worth we've also got elemental blood let me actually have a look in here so darts mythical are the best we're gonna get otherwise um arrows surely a tyrannosaurus tooth tipped metal tranquilizer arrow okay that's not quite what i was thinking of what i was kind of thinking of was may as well learn that mythic kibble why not do we have like what's beyond the darts we're currently using these spears surely 25 times stronger than a normal water water dart oh these are for underwater taming of course of course they're not for above ground stuff all right so i think the darts we're using are the best darts we can possibly be getting um so that's promising that's good to know all right well i'm gonna let this stuff craft up we got a kibble might even be able to get some more kibble and then uh we're gonna try and go get our hands on a hydro we can get another 15 look at that i probably don't need that much yeah i might save some of those resources so let's get let's get five more let's get 15 total i'm gonna let this stuff craft up and then um we'll go tame some stuff so good news and bad news i relogged and uh yeah <laughs> i guess everything's gone it wasn't uh it wasn't a i don't know it wasn't a mod i don't know what happened mod got removed i updated it before i jumped in the the game today so i don't, I don't know what happened there but it's gone it's kind of a shame uh good news is we got plenty of kibble and plenty of tranks so fingers crossed we can make this work uh i guess we'll leave you home for the time being i, got, I guess we're probably better off flying for today's journey i still don't know where, where whiplash has gotten to did i get whiplash killed and i'm like am i just completely forgetting this or something no he's out here somewhere where is he oh he's okay i left him <laughs> i guess i left him out there wow uh poor guy i'm a terrible owner what can i say all right let's get our guys some movement speed because we can and we're still pretty slow unfortunately but it is what it is now we know who we're going to be going for when it comes to a hydro team we've got these turtles over here who are oh supply drop what's inside of there not a whole lot soap and lemons um but no that's a level oh hello alpha how you doing maybe i should have brought my spino with me um but there was a second turtle up here somewhere i thought 
Or was it a male that we were looking at this entire time? I thought there were two of them up here. Uh, there's another one down there. I want a low level. I just want like an easiest team possible. Five kibble. It's, it's more expensive than I was hoping for is the only problem here. I want to keep things as cheap as we can. So let's go and check out our little finder thing and have a look at what we've got. Oh, you know what? <laughs> oh, like now, now I'm teasing myself because there's, there's an Alice. Oh, it's only level 40 and it's a female. Okay. Uh, we've got Beast of Bufos, female and male. I don't know how many kibble it's going to need. It's also in the swamp, which is a little bit less than ideal. Baryonyx, level 560. Oh, that's going to be expensive. Uh, most of these are water. Kairuku, though. We got a female all the way up the top of the map. Maybe I'll pay that a visit. Get a little penguin laying us some eggs. Zarko, level 520 and a 360 at the top of the map. Uh, piranhas. There's hydro piranhas out here. That might be a really cheap tame. If you can... Oh, but where am I going to put it? I'm going to somehow bring it back to base. I don't really know how I'm going to do that. So I guess, like, honestly, the easiest choice is definitely going to be a turtle. They're everywhere. Um... In fact, there's a level 60 female just up here. There's also a level 40 just over there. All right, I'm going to track both of them. They're both really close. Um, and I guess we'll... I'm about to run out of stamina. I'm going to regain some stamina and we'll pay these two guys a visit. All right. So um, I wish it was as smooth sailing as it has looked, but I crashed again. It seems that there's something in the swamp that my game is just not agreeing with. Uh, so fingers crossed that doesn't happen again. I think it's the brood mother, but we'll see. But now though, I guess we'll turn our attention to this guy. I might be able to knock this out with a single dart. We're going to have to have a look and see how this goes. But if I could headshot it, or at least avoid the shell, uh, or any other dangers that might exist around here, we might be golden for a very quick and easy team here. Let's find out. Oh, so close. Um, oh gosh, Trudon. No, 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 please don't, please don't, please don't. Go, go, go. Oh, come on, I don't want to waste another shot on this. A whole dart, no, we got arrows, we got arrows. Okay, good, good, good. Um, I don't have anything strong enough to take this Trudon down though, do I? I only do like 100 damage with my guy here. I could shoot it and knock it out, but I don't need it. I don't need it. I'm trying to preserve my resources here. Um, okay, if I can get like, a oh, Mythic, Dranodon. Dude, I can't tame it anyways. I need like shadow kibble for that or something. Shadow? I think I need shadow kibble for that. Uh, but we're good. Yeah, I really do not want to waste another dart on this. Something's roaring. Let's go, 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 go. I got him. All right, he's out. He's out. Tell me that Trudon isn't about to attack it though. He's kind of just chilling next to it. Please don't. Please just leave it alone. Um, I don't know where that roar came from. But I think we're okay. Can I pick this guy up? <laughs> All right, I gotta be careful. This thing might be able to one-shot me if he gets a hit on me. So I'm just gonna carry him all the way over here and we'll drop him. Lovely. All right, we've got ourselves... Well, we're about to get ourselves a hydro turtle, but I think we've done the hard work. So that's the main thing. Two kibble coming right up one and two am i gonna need probably not gonna need any team helpers we're good fantastic um squeeze me what are you doing all right turtle did not deal a lot of damage either so let's not let him get into any trouble all right let's get him back home and we've got our turtle secured nice the question now becomes do we get a second one there is one, like I said. Oh yeah, that's the one back at base. There's another one just over here, lower level. Um, the reason I didn't stop to tame it though is because there's alpha dodos and stuff that can kick my butt. And another two kibble. It's affordable. It's probably even a very smart idea. I could most certainly knock this thing out with a single hit. If we can just avoid any dangers, that would be perfect. Um, turtle, you turn around for me, dude. I don't like this. All right, you know what? I'm going to re-equip my grapple. I'm going to sit in the tree. <laughs> going to take precautions. I don't feel like dying right now. And dart in the head. 
And that's going to do it with ease. With ease. There we go. Lovely, lovely, lovely. All right. These guys are distracted over there. Let's hop down. All right. One kibble. Two kibble. And he's going to eat him straight away. Help me. Help me. Help me. Oh, no, no, no. No, my armor. <laughs> it broke like instantly. Oh, no. Okay, I hope my turtle's okay over there. I hope he's all right. Uh, you good, mate? You good? You got this? Oh, he's fighting another turtle of all things? All right, I'm safe. That's all that, that's, that's the important thing right now. It's time for me to save my friend. Let's get him out of here. And we're good. Double turtle tame. That is what I'm to. Oh, hello. Volcanic Raptor. Hello, how you doing? I mean, I'm down for it. Dang it. <laughs> it's a male. If it was a female. Oh my goodness. The eggs that we could pull would be amazing. Um, but no, it isn't. Let's have a peek. One more look though. We've got a volcanic. We've got two hydros. Ideally, another volcanic would be great. But if we can complete the trifecta now. Elec. Uh, to Rick. If we could complete the trifecta. That might be amazing. Dude, there's a female electric allosaurus up there. Die bears. I don't even know if die bears lay eggs. Diplocorlus. There's a male. Um, electric rex. Wait, what? It's like right here. Wait, there's one right here as well. Level 20s? And then both females. It's not what I had in mind. But... Uh, <laughs> I haven't seen one of these before. No, did he's one kibble as well. I mean, like, I kind of feel like we got it. Oh, my goodness. You're going to make it really easy for me, too. He's got, like, electric stuff emanating from him as well. Dude, I got to make this happen. This could be a really easy tame. I really shouldn't be doing this right here. Oh, my goodness. What am I doing? Okay, this thing might actually. I don't know how strong it's going to be. Uh, let's pop over here though. Maybe not. Kind of want to be able to... I don't know. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. This is, good. This, this, this is perfect. Oh, look at him go. Oh, please. Please, please, please put that dart in that machine. Gun, whatever it is we're using here. One dart is off. Second dart is off. We don't have a lot of time. Okay. <laughs> too close. Too close. Too close. <gasps> All right. Okay. Um... One more is going to get the job done. If I can do it quick. All right, come over here, mate. Or you know what? Sit right there. Sit right there. Come on. Charge it up. There we go. And it's asleep. That's got to be asleep. Unfortunately, right in the middle of the river. But that's fine. I hope. Oh, electric piranha. Oh, I underestimated that one, didn't I? Damn. Oh, that's rough. But fair enough. Fair enough. Uh, I don't have a fly to get back out there, do I? That is unfortunate. What I might have, though, is... Oh, I can't even teleport to my last location either. How about... I can pull my... No, not my beta theory. I mean, I could run my beta theory out. You know what, buddy? I think it's time for you to come and save the day. Let's go. In fact, we can go to the green obelisk. That'll give us a little bit of a shortcut. Or not. Or not. Okay. Third time lucky. All right. What if I stand up? Wait, what? What's going on here? Green obelisk. Is it like out of his physical range or something? Wait, what is going on? This guy won't teleport. What if I get like right beneath you? Green obelisk. I've teleported you before, right? I'm so confused. What is going on here? Why won't this guy teleport? Green obelisk. Is this me or him? Oh, just me alone. Oh, lovely. Okay, that is so weird. Um, 
Not very helpful either. Or is it? Hold on. I've got to grapple. <gasps> we can grapple our way. Let's go. Oh, lucky I did too. Oh, snap. I can hear bodies being eaten like right behind me. This is so... Oh, I can see raptors too. And I'm running out of things that I'll be able to like grapple onto. Um, I'm so dead. I'm so dead. Go. I just need to get to my pteranodon. That's all I got to do. Run, 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 run. Oh, he's right on my tail. He's right on my tail. No, no. Up there. Yes. Okay, we're safe for the time being. Pteranodon, come get me. Wee. All right, we're good. And the Rex, how's he doing? Still asleep? Not that it's safe in there, but good to know. Um, yeah. Clearly, I probably shouldn't go down into that water. Um, maybe if I had my <laughs> my spino with me. But there are definitely still some piranhas down here. Um, unless can I like just sit right here? Or are we asking for trouble? This is a terrible idea. Am I gonna end up dying? Okay. That's gonna allow me to get back here quickly. This is gonna be so silly, but we're gonna go for it anyways. I'm gonna try and dismount my Pteranodon right on top of the back of this guy. Got it, got it. Oh, we somehow landed on his back too. Yes. All right, go over here. <laughs> yes. Oh, that is so cheesy, but it worked. Let's go. I'm such an... Oh my goodness, I'm going to die though. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Save me, Rex. Save me. Oh gosh. I don't want to die again. Don't let me die again. Okay, we're good. Okay, we're good. Okay. Back to the teleporter we go. And if I can get in there... No, didn't quite make it. But the good news for today is that we have managed to acquire one of each of the three elementals, which means all we got to do now is, well, technically wait. That is the bare minimum. We wait for the three of them, four of them technically, to lay us the eggs that we need. Um, or we just go and tame some more of them and get eggs again by waiting. But anyways, guys, we're ending this one here. Thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy it, please go ahead, push that thumbs up, make it rain those thumbs ups. But most of all, they have a fantastic day. I'll catch you next time. Bye for now.